Typhoon Doxury swept into China's southeastern Fujian province on Friday, bringing heavy rain and violent gusts of wind that shook power lines, uprooted trees, and forced factories and shopping centers to shut. The second strongest typhoon to land in fusion after the deadly Typhoon Maranti in 2016 also forced the closure of schools and the evacuation of workers from offshore oil and gas fields, state media reported. There were no immediate reports of injuries or fatalities. Dokshiri's wind speed was clocked at 85.1 miles per hour, 137 km, as of 1 p.m. local time, according to China's National Meteorological Center. Hourly rainfall in Xemen, Quantu, and Pushan exceeded 50 millimeters, the China Meteorological Administration said. Social media video showed electrical power lines sparking and bursting into flames in Jinjiang, a city of 2 million, while in Quanzhou, massive trees were uprooted and left in the middle of roads. A woman's voice in the background of one video shouted, So many fallen trees. Some are broken down. It is a mess. This is too much. It is horrible. Videos showed strong winds blowing a large incense burner across the ground at a temple in Jianjing. Residents made makeshift barriers at doors to stop rain from flooding into apartments. There were power and water cuts in some areas of Jinjiang and Quanzhou. Dokshiri, the second typhoon to make landfall in China in less than two weeks, will move north bringing heavy rain to 10 provinces, forecasters say. It will move over the agricultural province of Anhui, dumping rain on its developing corn, rice, soybean, and cotton crops. Analysts say it should weaken by then, but are watching closely for potential crop damage. <laughs> 